Hello, YouTube today. How you guys doing? Welcome to the Arj Review Show. Or my username, Hero895 Review Show. Okay, today I'm going to be talking about upcoming movies for this year and next year. I know it's only the beginning of the year. But let's start off with a, a movie that lot. There's only. It's an official trailer. It's from European film that came out. It's a film festival that show uh, it's an actual trailer for Jurassic Park for which is called Jurassic World. Um, just type in um, Jurassic World official trailer one, and a lot not a lot of people know this that the trailer exists already. It's a leaked ass trailer on YouTube. And it's real. It's just test footage, but it's real. It's not. It's not even test footage. It's an actual trailer. It's a pre-production trailer. Um. And I'm not lying about this because not a lot of people know the trailers out there already, which it is. I was one of the first ones to got to see the trailer, even though the CGI and the special effects are all because it's pre it's a pre trailer leading up to the final trailer, probably come out late this year or early next year for Jurassic World, Jurassic Park Four, or whatever they want to call it. This is called Jurassic World. So just type it up, Jurassic World or Jurassic Park. I actually have to type Jurassic World. Jurassic World um, uh, official trailer one. In order to see the trailer, it shocks me to know that not a lot of people know about the trailer. It only has 1,799 views. Because peop those people are in the know, the rest of you aren't. I'm just letting you guys know right now. Um, speaking of which, I have the whole trilogy. Uh, here we go. As you can see, from Jurassic Park, the franchise, the franchise collection, Adventure Pack. Um, I know I'm trying not to make this a long video. I almost made a 15 minute hour video. I'm trying to make this a five minute video. Um, I see, you can see there. See. I have the franchise open and up. Most of the movies I have, most of all of them, are getting sequels or reboots. Either this for this year and next year. Most of the movies I have. So most of the movies I have have to do with the upcoming blockbusters of this year and 2015. I know it's early, but I'm gonna go ahead and open this right here. See. Oop. I was lucky to see the back right here. I don't know if you can see you guys see that. Um, I was lucky enough when I got this when I did. Um, look, open up Dress Park One, The Lost World Dress Park, and Dress Park Three. See, what you guys can see. Um, I was lucky. I was really lucky when I got this, cause this shit went up in price, just because of digital copies. I got this for twenty bucks. When I was on sale, look at me. I love Jurassic Park. I love fucking dinosaurs eating people. That's the what the whole Jurassic Park series is about. Well, not really. It's more intelligent DNA, DNA cloning and shit. I think that shit's possible. If you get something ancient like the DNA from a museum, you see the dinosaur bones. They still have DNA. I'm imagine copying that. Oh man, that should be scary. Um, but I wouldn't want dinosaurs running around. They had the chance. They had their chance at life. Um, they a little, yeah, little bit. Um, let's see the back here. Sorry if you can see that. But anyways, um, my review for Jurassic Park One will be kind of a seven out of ten, due to the fact that it's kind of boring at the beginning. Ooh, don't get me on start this one. The Lost World. That's not boring, it's an 8 out of 10 due to the fact it starts boring at first and boom, boom, snap, snap, action, action. Oh, Dress of Park 3 will probably give out a 9 out of 10 due to the fact it's non-stop action, peril, and um, suspense. So, but anyways, I'm going to be updating my videos. Um, on th this is one of the trilogies that I have as being a, uh, I don't even want to call it a reboot or a sequel. Most I think it's a sequel, actually it's a sequel due to the fact that's taking place, taking place back when, where, not when, where, taking place 
where the first Jurassic Park took place, meaning it's that either what's his name's grandson took fix things that his grandfather couldn't. Um, they they could control the dinosaurs. I guess somebody or his grandson, the John Hammond's grandson, took control. I guess, and the, I know that the end of the first one, all that, the T Rex, everything was it, it was just left loose. So I'm really excited. I don't know about you guys, but I'm really excited. Just go. It's like it's like memories all over. It's like seeing. I'm really excited for them to go back to the first island, Isa Lubar, whatever you say it. And to see, because I always want to see like what happened after they all left, like John Hammond and Dr. Grant and Dr. Malcolm. I wanted to see what happened after they left those dinosaurs and what happened to them. And like, everyone's been asking that question. But all overall, I'll probably give this trilogy a 9 out of 10. It's really good. Um, but most of the stuff I'm going to be making YouTube videos is about the movies I have, as you can see. And again, sequels and reboots for this year. Big blockbuster movies. I'm talking about Batman, um, Batman vs. Superman, that stuff. On, um, Avengers 2, um, Guardians of the Galaxy, um, Star Wars Episode 7. I have the whole Star Wars saga, so that's a for other time. But let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Like, I would appreciate it. And um, let me have you guys' opinions. Are you guys excited for Jurassic Park 4 or World of Everyone? It's actually Jurassic World, but it's taking place at the very where the very first one took place. So I'm really excited. I don't know about you guys, but please let me know what you guys think and comment below and like. Uh, and I'll be doing more giveaways later on. Okay. Bye bye YouTube.